what's going on guys so i was going to talk a little bit about uh, a pep mod that uh, philip chambly out of uh, georgia makes for these drake meters it's uh these meters are notoriously known for being extremely accurate but they only read average power so kind of the only way to to really test your uh, your radio on it is in a mode um ready rtty mode and i was gonna i've got i don't have a dimmer yet for this led so i've just got it taped on there <laughs> I don't know why it looks so bright. It looks really bright on there, but um, so basically for this meter, and he makes these for all meters. If you have a meter that you uh, like that that shows average time, you can see in the back here is it's up for for PEP and down for your average power. He's got a. Uh, a couple posts here one adjust your hang time and the other one on the right adjust your accuracy of your meter so what you want to do is you want to put it on a dummy load and uh, i prefer psk or or sorry rtty and uh, go ahead 100 watts on your radio into a dummy load key it up whatever the dummy load sh or the uh, meter shows on average that's what you want to calibrate your pep setting with so uh, this little guy over here does that and i went through all the bands and made sure everything was dead on and, and adjusted the hang time i do like a little bit of hang time on mine especially uh for CW running the amp because I can flip it, you know, to average and tune the amp, uh, or I've got it set with a, just kind of a, a smidgen of hang time on it. But anyway, um, it comes with two wires. One, one goes to the meter and the other one goes to the resistor that's connected to the meter. You just clip it and solder, not a big deal but it really makes these drake meters um, shine because that's the only really thing that they didn't nail on them right was the pep but so it's showing about 90 watts so I'll reach back here and turn the switch to average and this is it doesn't affect the meter reading whatsoever as far as accuracy so see it's showing it's trying to bounce over 60 and again the best way to to tune these is tune it with a solid carrier with no uh, envelopes that, that are have noise on them like am and fm stuff like that just reach back there and turn it up to pep and so it's uh, it's a nice feature you can buy these with uh let me show you so if, if you, you can buy this, it's a piece of aluminum that he makes, he fabricates, and it's kind of just like an L, and it uses the factory screws, and you just take the factory screws out, go ahead and solder your connections and put it in. It does require anywhere from 9 volts to 15. I would keep it probably around 12, 12 or 13, or maybe 14. You know, you can run it through your power supply. It's an RCA plug, and mine looks like crap because I didn't have any... Uh, you know, um, heat shrink tubing because I've lost it like everything else that I have. But anyway, um, RCA powered. You can unplug it if you just want to run the uh, average on the on the Drake meter or any other meter. 
and it just you know it's plugged into a, a, a wall wart that's under the desk that runs kind of leds and stuff but i'm in the process of getting a dimmer <laughs> and what i'm going to do is i'm going to mount this kind of sideways just barely on the on the side there but leds will blind you you know they'll blind you it doesn't matter what color it seems like the more blue you get the more you know the more blinded you get by them so <laughs> these ones are are really bright i definitely need a dimmer for them but anyway guys check out uh if you have a drake meter and you want it to read pep -E like i do uh, check out philip uh, or phil k4 delta papa kilo uh, you can find him on qrz.com and he shows you he also makes VFO stabilizers, and he also makes these for all kinds of watt meters. So, uh, if you have a, uh, sorry, if you have a, uh, a real cherry of a, of a Drake or an older meter that you really like, that doesn't have this option, it makes it really nice. And th these meters don't cost much, probably like $75 or something, and I really like it because it's very accurate, you know. But uh, yeah, there's a look at that, and <laughs> I have to fix this. It's kind of just rigged up there, and put a dimmer switch on it. That way, I can dim that down. But anyway, just wanted to show you guys that, and hope you guys are having a good week and staying cool. It's it's hot, so we'll catch you guys later. The uh, K4 DPK uh, PEP Deluxe for the, the Drake W4. 7-3, guys.